please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, Understanding the Differences Between Java and Python Garbage Collection Introduction Garbage collection is a crucial aspect of memory management in modern programming languages, ensuring that unused objects are automatically reclaimed to free up memory. Java and Python are two popular programming languages, both known for their garbage collection mechanisms. However, they differ significantly in their approaches to garbage collection. In this tutorial, we'll explore why Java and Python's garbage collection methods are different and provide code examples to illustrate these differences. Java Garbage Collection Java uses a garbage collector based on a generational garbage collection algorithm. It divides objects into two generations, young and old. Here's how it works. A young generation, newly created objects are initially allocated in the young generation. The young generation is further divided into three areas, Eden Space, Survivor Space 1, and Survivor Space 2. B Eden Space, objects are initially allocated here. C Survivor Spaces, Objects that survive garbage collection in the young generation are moved to one of the survivor spaces. D. Old generation, objects that continue to survive multiple garbage collection cycles in the young generation are promoted to the old generation. Java's garbage collector uses various algorithms like the garbage first, G1, collector or the parallel collector, depending on the JVM configuration. Example. Java. Example, Python. Key differences. Generational versus reference counting. Java uses generational garbage collection, which is efficient for managing short lived objects, whereas Python relies primarily on reference counting with a cyclic garbage collector for handling circular references. Automatic memory management. Both languages offer automatic memory management but the mechanisms and algorithms they use are different. Control over garbage collection, Java provides more control over garbage collection tuning through JVM flags and options, allowing developers to optimize for specific use cases. Python's garbage collection is less configurable. Performance impact, the choice of garbage collection method can affect the performance of a program. Java's generational approach can reduce the frequency of garbage collection cycles for short-lived objects, potentially improving performance in certain scenarios. Conclusion Java and Python have different garbage collection methods because they target different use cases and have different design philosophies. Understanding these differences is essential for developers to write efficient and performant code in these languages. Developers should consider the characteristics of their application and choose the language that aligns with their requirements and expectations for garbage collection. ChatGPT